So many of Yeats's paintings relate to a scene the artist witnessed when he was out and about, often captured in his trusted notebook, which was always close to hand. The waterfall at Glencar, some eight miles from Sligo town, was a favoured location for the Yates children. And as they grew up, Jack and his brother W.B. often returned to that setting. And Yates himself used the backdrop of the waterfall in various paintings, while his brother wrote several poems that also recalled the Glencar waterfall. The first thing that strikes the viewer is the dense vegetation that runs across the canvas, the white and pasto of the water tumbling down in the background. However, what lifts this painting out of the ordinary is the couple that appear in the bottom left of the work. The attractive woman leading the way with her umbrella keeping back the shrubbery, with her admirer close behind. They in no way look like a couple dressed for the task in hand, and this surely is what appealed to Yeats. They look far more like as if they were on their way to a smart luncheon party, rather than delving through the dense waterfall foliage. Perhaps their incongruity appealed to the artist. Regardless, it has enabled Yeats to create a real gem of a painting. 